Hey guys, uh, welcome back. Um, today we're gonna start working on the Hulk machine. Uh, we're gonna see if I could get that turbo out of there today. Uh, let me show you what I got going on. So, to help me organize and keep things semi clean and know where all the hardware goes, I have these Ziploc bags. I got a little Sharpie. So, what I can do is just write down what, what I have in a bag and where do they go. Like, this is for the downpipe. Got a bunch of tools up here ready. First thing I'm going to do is get the strut bar out of the way. Start peeling this off. Uh, I'm going to label all these hoses or where they go. Um, and uh, start removing the uh, intake manifold and all these piping out of here. All right, so I, I removed everything that was up here. For some reason, I don't know if this is a connector or not, it won't come apart, but the wiring harness goes under there. Um, but yeah, I think I loosened all this up now, so we should be able to take this off. coolant hose that I missed down there. As suspected, Let's see if I can get that to focus down there. See the oil in there? So, which means that the uh, seals cracked. There you go, get some light. Which pretty much means the seals are, uh, are shot. Probably need to be replaced. I don't know, we'll see how much extensive damage there is on the uh, turbo fins. And um, yeah, we'll go from there. So now, what I'm going to do is uh, remove th these bolts. I got this one off down here already, all the uh, downpipe. I took all that off. And then uh, remove all these uh, feed lines, these oil lines here. These are all vacuum, vacuum. Yep. So remove the uh, banjo here, which supplies oil to the turbo. Get that out of the way and I should be able to pull this turbo out. Look at that, all that oil from here. Alright guys, so I got the turbo out. As you can see, if you look close in there, you can see broken fins. Look at all that shaft play in there. So Unfortunately, maybe uh, this turbo is not salvageable. So I'm gonna go ahead and let Dave know that he's gonna need a new turbo. I'm gonna go ahead and tear this open still and kind of inspect the inside, and maybe if I could just get a new uh, compressor wheel, I'll go ahead and do that if he wants, or just go ahead and just get a uh, turbo upgrade. These fins are shot. They're all grounded down. There's a lot of shavings in the uh, intercooler piping, so we gotta re remove all the piping and uh, clean it all out. 
Um, there was some scarring on the uh, compressor. So I just spoke to Dave and I told him what was going on. His plan is uh, to possibly get another turbo. He's going to source out what his options are. And uh, that's what I'm going to be waiting for. After I get that new turbo, I'm just going to go ahead and install it. Um, if we do need to make a new downpipe to adapt to it, that's fine. But at the same time, I told him that I want to clean up this engine bay and sort through all this mess here and get it more organized and clean um i found like you know wire nuts so stuff like that i just got to go through it and you know make it look presentable yet purposeable and eliminate any possible uh failure that may cause through wiring since the car is here in my house and i don't mind doing it so stay tuned for the next build or the next part of the